Just in time to meet our Roanoke Valley SPCA Pet of the Week, Sylvie Peterson, joining us this morning to introduce us to Pookie. Pookie. You can see the gray in her. She's got yes. a little bit of aging there, but you'd never tell it from her attitude. No. She is an eight-year-old Beagle Australian Shepherd mix, but she is definitely young at heart. She loves to go for walks. She likes to explore everything. And, of course, she loves those little scratches and rubs. <laughs> oh, she does. Um, she came to us, actually, with her sister. Her sister got adopted, and now okay. she's sitting back here thinking, why? I need a home. I need a home. And, um, but she is a sweetheart. Being only 25 pounds, even if she tries to pull, you know, she doesn't pull right. much. But she's very good on the leash. She likes car rides, sticking her head out the window. She stuck her head out the window the whole way here. <laughs> There's, even on a cold day, it's just all about the ears flapping of in course. the wind. Um, but she is, she's gentle. She's very gentle. You can see here, she's just kind of sitting beside me. She wants to be pet. She wants to be loved. Good with other animals? Yes. Yes. Oh, and she, good. she grew up with, you know, her sister there, so she's used to having canine companionship. Perfect. She hasn't shown much interest in the cats when we walk by that area, so she may be good with cats, but, you know, we can't tell sure. that. Yeah. And holidays coming up. Yes. You all have a big push for some help. Yes, we call that Home for the Holidays yes. Foster Program. And our goal is to have every single cat and dog in the shelter be in a home, even if only for a week over the holidays, experience that love and joy of a family over um, the Christmas week. So beginning December 21st through 23rd, you can come in, you fill out the application, and you can bring one of these critters home and then bring them back somewhere around the 26th through the 28th. If it turns out... If you out, want to bring them back, right? If you want to bring them back. And if you don't, we call that a foster failure, which is a great term. Um, <laughs> if you don't, you can adopt them, and there will even be a discounted adoption fee. Oh, that's wonderful. And I'm sure it gives you, the folks at the SPCA a little bit of a break, to knowing that there's good homes and... Yes, that is that is our goal. We know that, you know, while we give them as much love and affection as we can there, nothing beats a home. No, so true. Mm -hmm. Sylvie, thanks so much for coming in and talking to us this morning.